There, put this on. This is chrome. I can see my own reflection. Chrome. Let me tell you something. That's a $1,200 Valentino suit, okay? And if you spill anything on it, I'm gonna mess you up good. Hey, shut up. You're making them nervous. If he gets nervous and fucks this up, they'll kill him for sure. What? This is insane. No, got... yeah, it's all right, Doc. Let's go over it again. <sighs> Mr. Vitti's been detained. Apologies all around, but a beep, but a bop, but a boop. And then you say you're the new consigliere, and you're prepared to speak for Mr. Vitti. And then what? And then you keep your mouth shut and hope nobody asks you nothing. <laughs> That's some fucking plan you got there. Shut up, Doc. If you got to talk, drink. Try to be vague. Could you do that? I'm a psychiatrist. Believe me, I can be vague. Oh, Kelly, I can't do this. Don't fucking whine. Whining's a dead giveaway. Blend. Blend in. Oh. Hey. Hey. Oh. So where's B? He ain't here. He ain't here. How you doing? Hey, how you doing? All right. How you been? Yeah. All right? Right. Oh. Hey, when'd you guys get out? You need anything, you let me know. Oh. Oh. Hey, 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 I. Oh. Oh, kiss the budget. Hey, Easter weekend. Huh? Huh? You're a planet. Blend. Who's the guy with Joe? I've never seen him before. Oh, he's just, uh, it's okay. Forget about it. Forget about it? What the hell is that? Forget about it. I can't do this. Look, I can't do this. Jump. <laughs> All right, gentlemen, I think we're going to get started here. Uh, we got a lot to talk about here today, and for now, we're just going to stick with the more important issues, all right? Well, and one more thing. If you got anything to say, let us know who you are, because a lot of us here don't know each other. And I didn't think anybody here was into wearing fucking name tags. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> I'm Primo Sedone. They call me Sonny Long. Some of you know me as Mikey Gaga. Some of you know me as Joey Boombats. Be as it may. It's good to see so many of the old faces here and to welcome some of the new ones from all over the country. I see Joe Baldazar, Frankie Zello. But I'm a little disappointed that the head of our other New York family isn't here today. All I see is his man Jelly and some sort of little prick nobody knows. Yeah, uh, well, well, uh, the thing is, uh, Mr. Beatty, Mr. Beatty's uh, been detained. Plus, he's, he's sorry. For his detainment. Detained? What kind of bullshit is that? What's more important than this? As the host of this meeting, I take his not being here as a sign of disrespect to me and all these other men, too, who came a long way to be here. Uh, yeah. I mean, I mean, no. I mean, what, you, you see, the thing is that he's not feeling well. Plus, uh, you don't feel good. Jelly! What's the matter with you? We never discuss Mr. Vitti's health outside the family. You know better than that. Sit down. You want a fresh one? All right, who is this guy? What the fuck is he doing here? Who I am? Who I am? Who, who am I? Who am I is a question for the ages. That's one we're all searching for to find out who I am, who's in there, who wants to come out and go, hey, I'm hungry. Who I am is too deep and, and perf almost you got to go in deep and pull out the thing, like with that movie where the thing came out of the stomach and ate up the people on the fucking spaceship. May they rest in peace. My name is Ben Sobel. Leone. Ben Sobel Leone. I'm also known as uh, Benny the Groin, Sammy the Schnoz, uh, Elmer the Fudd, Tubby the Tuba, and once as Miss Phyllis Levine. But that was at a party, it was years ago. I smoked at the Tupet and I had a Quakalud, and then suddenly I'm in fishnets and singing show tunes. These things happen, but it has nothing to do 
with what I'm here with you fine gentlemen today. So I apologize. That being said, I am also known to the people who know me the best as the fucking duck. The second part of your question that you asked me is uh, why am I here? I am here <clears throat> representing Mr. Paul Vitti as his consigli glary. <laughs> Never correct me in public again. Do you understand that? Uh, you broke my heart, Jelly. You broke my heart. I apologize for the second interruption. As Mr. Vitti's consigliere, I am intimately involved in all aspects of the Vitti family business, and I am prepared to speak for Mr. Vitti on all matters. Bada bing, bada boom, betty boom. Okay, doctor. Let's stop with the bullshit. Everybody knows there's been this thing between me and Paul Vitti for a long time. Which thing are you talking about? The first thing or the second thing? What second thing? I only know one thing. Hey! How can we bring up the first thing if we're not going to talk about the second thing? Did you talk to the guy? What guy? The guy with the thing. What thing? What the fuck are you talking about? How should I know? You brought it up. See, this is the whole problem. You see this? You see what's happening here? You can't have an intelligent conversation with this guy. Who? Well, how about if I put two bullets in the back of your fucking brain? What do you think of that? I don't know. That's a little dark. What do you think about that? What do I think? I think it's a good idea. Why would I say it if I didn't think it was good? I don't know. Why would you? I wouldn't. That's what I'm saying. Oh, 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 oh. Look at what's happening here. Look at you. Do you feel you have to get angry to be heard so people will listen to you? Is that your deal? What is he talking about? I don't know, but you do have a tendency to get angry a lot. I agree, Primo. I'm trying to talk about Vidi. Why are we talking about me? Oh, oh. That's interesting, too. Do you feel you're not uh, important enough for us to discuss you? What does that mean? What do you think I mean? Hey, fuck you!